All right, it's finally out. It's it's Arrow. It's season seven. It's ep episode one. This was a really really good episode. Uh, wow. Now the episode, of course, starts off like every Arrow episode, or at least every Arrow premiere, with a running sequence. Now this time it is William running away from Diaz and running towards Felicity. Now I'm kind of glad that it was William running this time and not Oliver, because it would be kind of weird if Oliver was running around in prison. And then we saw Diaz actually shoot and kill Felicity. She actually died, and she is never coming back. Amazing. Not just kidding, she didn't actually die. It was just, you guessed it, a dream sequence of Oliver Queen in prison. Now, I think they're doing this, you know, Felicity dying too much. They shouldn't just, I mean, yeah. They're doing it too much. I mean, I think it's like four or five times where she, she was shot one time by uh, Damien Dark's men. Then she was killed in the crossover with um, with the Hawks. And then she died again. I think this is the third time. Correct me if I'm wrong. Then we see the opening, which they could definitely have done better. But I really like how it's, you know, the edges on the arrow are shining. That's really cool. And we meet Stanley, who is obviously going to be Oliver's buddy in prison. And I really like him. I don't think he's come from the comics. And we see basically, you know, um, Derek Sampson, who is Stardust, Bronze Tiger, and Brick. Um, we see those guys, and apparently, you know, Bronze Tiger's getting taken away and stuff. And they want Oliver to kind of join their crew or whatever. We then see Oliver interacting with Brick. Now, Brick definitely appeared more in this episode than I thought he would. He was like... Probably the main character in prison next to Oliver. And then we see for the first time in this episode the copycat Green Arrow. And I didn't expect this at all. But the copycat Green Arrow storyline was my favorite storyline of the episode. I thought it would be the Oliver in prison stuff. But it was not. And we then see, you know, Oliver having a heartfelt talk with Diggle. And we then cut to Felicity who is doing her stuff. As usual, now I think Felicity in this episode is the best she's ever been. Yes, even better than in season one and two. I didn't, I thought she was okay in season one and two. She wasn't like my favorite, but she was okay. Um, yeah, but this episode is the best she's ever been, in my opinion, of course. You are free to have your own. And my thoughts on Dinah being the new captain of police. Um, I mean, it's a big jump from where she was in season six, um, but yeah, it's fine. I don't really care. I really, really, I really liked Renee this episode. He was really cool, uh, the way he was training these kids, and we even found out that he's, you know, helping the copycat Green Arrow, um, with whatever he's doing. He was where we saw that he was on the rooftop wearing the wild dog costume. And we then see a flashback of who I believe is the copycat Green Arrow because we see the copycat Green Arrow and we zoom in on him and then there's a, this flashback of a boat sailing towards Leon Yu and there's this guy on the boat who's screaming and I'm guessing that is who the copycat Green Arrow is. And I think Black Siren wasn't really that much in the episode. I would have liked to see more of her. And we then see Dinah and Renee talking at Diggle. This scene was okay. And we see some Leon Yu where two people are walking. And we then see where freaking some guy is watching over them. Like some, like he's stalking them. He's really creepy. And my favorite scene in the episode was probably this scene here with Diaz attacking. Actually, it was my second favorite scene. But it was sort of one scene because we saw Diaz beating the, or Felicity and Diaz beating the crap out of each other. And then we saw kind of at the same time it switched between Diaz and Felicity fight and uh, Oliver in prison just beating up everyone completely and I kind of I count that as one scene so it was my favorite scene in the episode where Felicity was fighting Diaz uh, that was awesome as much as I don't, don't didn't like Felicity in the past I really think she was great in this episode but yeah Felicity was fighting Diaz and that was really cool and Oliver again in prison beating up the crap out of everyone in prison this is probably the most violent scene ever in arrow he was just beating the crap out of everyone throwing weights to people's faces it was awesome and oliver was 
he just kind of felt like a bad guy this episode. He let, you know, he let Brick and uh, Stardust just beat the crap out of Stanley. I felt really bad for Stanley. And we see, like, what is, in my opinion, the best Felicity scene from Arrow, which is Oliver and Felicity talking in prison. That was really emotional. I hope if they're going to do Felicity for the rest of the season, I hope it's going to be like this. And we then see that uh, the copycat Green Arrow has, um, you know, a list just like Oliver had in season one, which is kind of cool. I like like I said before, the copycat Green Arrow storyline was my favorite of the episode. And then we see fucking incredible, like, uh, we see some guy on, uh, Leon Yu, and he lifts, like, the hose up, and he says, uh, I think he says, my father's Oliver, Oliver Queen, and then Roy Harper comes out of nowhere and says, like, William. I was just like, what the, what the, I was jumping around, I couldn't contain myself what the actual heck so is roy the copycat green arrow i mean i think it's roy harper i mean it i don't know who else it could be i mean we saw in obviously this is flash forward as this is the guy with the hose in his william <laughs> what the hell is going on freaking old man roy talking to william i if they're gonna do you know flash forwards for the rest of the season I'm fine with that, but I'm probably, I think this is great. The only problem I have with this is they should have just named William Connor Hawk instead to make it more comic book accurate. That's, that's my only problem. Wow, this episode, I'm going to go on record and say that it was the best premiere ever of the Arrowverse. Because, wow, this was incredibly good. Alright guys, what did you think of the episode? Did you like it? Or did you not like it? I personally liked it a lot. I will uh, be uploading my um, all Arrow season premieres ranked soon. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Eh? Oh, damn, voice cry. And bye.